Sicilian defense, Chekhov or variation, 4, and C65. BB5. Sudden a close game that was lost by a mistake. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. The middle game battle was fairly even. Sharp games are frequently the result of starting with the king's pawn since it dominates the center and frees up the bishop and queen on the light squares. The C pawn in the Sicilian defense controls the D4 square. Nf3 moves the knight toward the center in anticipation of a pawn push on D4, where it will be ready to retake the piece if black captures on D4. When black eventually plays Nf6, white is prevented from moving the piece to E5 by the opening of the light squared bishop on D6. D4 offers to trade the D pawn for the C pawn, giving up a center pawn for more active pieces. Cx D4 gives black two central pawns versus one central pawn for white. Qx D4 recaptures the pawn and develops the queen to a center square. And C6 develops the knight toward the center, attacks the queen on D4 and controls the E5 square. BB5 develops the bishop and pins the C6 knight, stopping black from capturing the white queen. This threatens to win a queen. This is an equal trade. Backs off. This develops a knight from its starting square, activating it. By doing this, a knight moves out of its beginning square and into the action. By doing this, a bishop moves out of its beginning square and into the action. The bishop will be better off as a result of this. The rooks can see each other now, allowing them to provide mutual defense. This activates a bishop by developing it off of its starting square. This is the only move that works. This develops a rook off its starting square, getting it into the action. Castling develops a rook, while also getting the king to safety. By castling to the opposite side of the board as the opponent, the game will tend to be more double-edged. This connects the rooks, which helps them coordinate together in the future. Games Master It is the final book action. By moving a rook from its starting square, this activates it. It is ideal. A very strong play. It is excellent. This loses a pawn. This threatens to win a knight. It is a mistake. This ignores an opportunity to win a pawn. This allows the opponent to kick a knight. It is a miss. A pawn kicks the opposing knight, forcing it to move or risk being captured. It is ideal. The knight is now on a square that is more secure. It is quite good. That's fine. It is good. There were worse moves, but also something much better. It is an inaccuracy. This is not the best. It is an inaccuracy. This is not the right idea. It is an inaccuracy. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. The game is still close to equal, but black lost their advantage. It is an inaccuracy. Very precise. It is best. There were worse moves but also something much better. It is an inaccuracy. This misses the chance to provide an equitable exchange of pieces. It is incorrect. This enables the adversary to capture a pawn and gain territory. It is incorrect. This captures a vulnerable pawn. It is best. Recaptures. It is quite good. Backs off. It is ideal. This causes material loss. It is incorrect. This overlooks an opportunity to win material. This permits the opponent to win a tempo by threatening a queen. It is an inaccuracy. When the queen retreats, this attack wins a tempo. It is ideal. This defends the attacked pawn. It is best. The knight is thus brought to safety. It is ideal. This wins time by threatening a queen and forcing it to move away. This is the only good move. It is a great move. This suggests exchanging items of equivalent value. That's good. This challenges the opposing rook for control of the open file. This is the only move that works. This threatens to win a bishop. It is a great move. That is a logical response. 
it is quite good. This removes the attacking rook. This is the only good move. It is best. This reveals an assault and puts a pawn in danger. It is ideal. Recaptures. It is ideal. The opposing bishop is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. It is best. This is a missed chance to offer an equal exchange of goods. It is incorrect. There was only one move that was effective, and this wasn't it. This misses a chance to make a pawn winning threat. It is incorrect. This blocks an attack on a vulnerable pawn. It is best. Black's situation was worse, but now they are losing. It is incorrect. That's a decent move. That's good. This suggests exchanging items of equivalent value. This poses a risk of winning a pawn. It is ideal. This reveals an assault that poses a threat to a bishop. It is ideal. This overlooks an opportunity to defend a bishop that was under attack. It is an inaccuracy. This buys time by putting a knight in danger and getting it to flee. It is ideal. This protects a knight who was being attacked and lacked defense. That's good. This wins time by threatening a bishop and forcing it to retreat away. It is ideal. This protects an underdefended bishop that is under attack. It is good. That pawn's capture grants you material. It is ideal. Among the best actions. It is quite good. This is how you take down a rook. It is ideal. Thus, a forced checkmate is possible. It is incorrect. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. That pawn was free for the taking. It is best. This is not the best. It is an inaccuracy. Thus, a forced checkmate is possible. It is incorrect. This is not the right idea. It is an inaccuracy. Sudden a close game that was lost by a mistake. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. The middle game battle was fairly even.